What's up everyone? My name is Paul and today I'm fixing the cigarette lighter outlet and adding a USB charger to my RAV4. In the 1990s, charging your phone wasn't a thing, but smoking cigarettes in your car was. I can't do either one right now, so let's fix it. Pull the trim piece straight out to remove it. Someone installed the wrong cigarette lighter in my RAV4 and it doesn't plug into the connector. I'm also working on the center console today, so let's take that out. It has two screws on each side and the shift knob needs to come off. There is one more screw in the cup holder, then just pull the console up and to the back of the car. I want to add this dual USB charger. I would actually get pretty mad if somebody smoked in my car and I don't like the way the ashtray looks. I'm removing it. Bend three tabs back to remove the metal ashtray holder. I'm not leaving a hole here, so I'm tracing the outline using a piece of paper. This is my template. I'm making the block off plate out of a kick panel that I got from the junkyard. It's the same type of plastic. After cutting it out with the Dremel tool, I use four screws to attach it to the center console. Inside the console, there's a ridge in the middle. I'll need to cut that down. Installing the USB charger into the plate I just made would be the obvious choice, but I don't want a USB cable to get kicked, so I'm installing it higher. I'm soldering the wires to the USB charger at a downward angle to save some space. I love heat shrink. It's better than electrical tape, and you can use colors to label the wires. I installed the USB charger. The back is hitting the cup holder. That's why I didn't use big spade terminals. I'm running the wires to the front of the center console where I will add a connector. Back to the cigarette lighter. This one came out of my car. The other two are from the junkyard. This one has the right cigarette lighter and the connectors. This other one has the black cover for the back of the lighter outlet. The junkyard trim pieces are nice, but it looks like mine is less sun faded. Let's start by taking this weird cigarette lighter apart. I have the right trim ring, but everything else is wrong. To take the lighter outlet apart, pry in these two places as you push the metal part down. Now I can take the gray piece out. My trim ring looks better than the junkyard trim ring, so I'm moving this piece over. Stick the trim back into the panel with the light bulb housing facing the middle. The metal part goes in with one terminal up and the other pointing right. Now the light cover and light can go back on. I'm also missing my spare switch covers, so I'm stealing them from the junkyard trim piece. They just snap into place. You can also buy brand new spare switch covers from Toyota in black. I almost forgot the lighter socket cover. That looks better. This is the cigarette lighter plug I cut from the wiring harness of the Junkyard RAV4. A regular spade terminal fits into the negative side, but the positive side is smaller. I'll just trim another terminal with the Dremel tool. I'm making a splice that will just plug into the factory wiring and send power to the USB outlet, but you can still plug in the cigarette lighter. Here's a diagram of what I'm doing. I'm not cutting the wiring in the car, just adding an adapter that will send power to the new USB outlet. With the center console back in the car, I'll just plug the spades into the car's original wiring. I still have the power and light connectors available for the 12 volt outlet. I picked up the storage compartment bracket from the junkyard. You can buy a brand new storage compartment from Toyota if you want. Now just plug the cigarette lighter in and snap the panel back in place. I'm plugging in this charger so I can test the outlet. It turns on with the key. And if I had friends, they would be able to charge stuff in the back too. Well, this car is very old and I can't change that, but at least now I can charge stuff and I can smoke cigs if I want to. That's all I have for now, and I'll see you guys next time.